The capture of Santa Fe, also known as the Battle of Santa Fe or the Battle of Cannoncita, took place near Santa Fe, New Mexico, the capital of the Mexican province of New Mexico, during the Mexican-American War on 8 August through 14 August 1846. No shots were fired. Background United States Army General Stephen W. Kearney had moved southwest from Fort Leavenworth, Kansas with about 1,700 men in his Army of the West. Kearney's orders were to secure the New Mexico Territory and Alta California. On August 9 in Santa Fe, Governor Manuel Armijo wanted to avoid battle, but Catholic priests, Diego Arculeta, and the young militia officers Manuel Chavez and Miguel Pino forced him to muster a defense. Armijo set up a position in Apache Canyon, a narrow pass about 10 miles southeast of the city. However, on August 14, before the American army was even in view, he decided not to fight. When Pino, Chavez, and some of the militiamen insisted on fighting, Armijo ordered the cannon pointed at them. The New Mexican army retreated to Santa Fe, and Armijo fled to Chihuahua. Capture Kearney and his troops encountered no Mexican forces when they arrived on August 15. Kearney and his force entered Santa Fe and claimed the New Mexico Territory for the United States without a shot being fired. Aftermath From Santa Fe, Kearney sent Colonel Alexander Donovan further south into Mexico. Kearney declared himself the military governor of the New Mexico Territory on August 18 and established a civilian government. He then took the remainder of his army west to Alta California. The New Mexicans put up no organized resistance until the Taos Revolt in early 1847, although in the month prior of December, 1846 planned revolt in Santa Fe, involving many leading Mexican loyalists, was discovered and disrupted by General Sterling Price. After being informed of the plot by Doné Chano Vigil, before it could be carried out, 